Hey everyone, happy Friday again from the cabana. Oh, another Friday is upon us. And guess what? I get to wear this shirt again. Well, officially, after Sunday, I get to. Because this shirt tells me where it's five o'clock somewhere, so I have a reason to have a drink. You know, you gotta, it's five o'clock somewhere. Well, I wanna know where. But see, this shirt doesn't work this time of the year. But after Sunday, it works. Because what's Sunday? Daylight saving time. So that means when we move the clocks ahead, that means I'll see you an hour early next time. Or an hour later. Uh, let's see, if we move the clocks, I don't know why we even do this to ourselves every year anyhow, right? It's stupid. There's, there's no good reason for it. We do this twice a year and mess ourselves up. Give me a good reason. You can't, you know why? Because there's not a good reason. I mean, some people say, oh, well, you know, it's, it's for school kids. Dude, this was this thing has been around since before school buses, all right? This has been around back when our parents' parents used to complain about walking through the snow and stuff. No, that ain't it. Um, some people say the farming, right? That makes no sense either, because trust me, farming is hard work. These people don't want an extra hour to do work. They want that sun to go down. And besides, the, the cows still got to be milked when they're ready to milk. It's not like... It's not like they're gonna change their clock. <laughs> I know, because I remember like years ago, when Jordan was a baby, Julie just about blew up because he wasn't hungry. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have shared that much. Point is that ain't it either. There is no good reason for it. And, and I mean, it's a stupid idea. You know who invented it? Ha, yeah, not Ben Franklin, no. A lot of people say Ben Franklin, no, he said, uh, early to bed, early to rise, makes a man healthy, wealthy, and wise. No, no, no. Early to bed means you missed a good party. And the reason why you're rising so early is because you missed a good party. Although, Ben Franklin, I bet, would be, be pretty good at a party. Because I heard he used to like to exercise in front of his window naked. Yeah, he'd, he'd probably fit in pretty good here at the cabana. The point is, Franklin didn't make that up. No, I did my research. Yeah. And you know what? It's some guy in New Zealand who wanted more time to look for bugs. Bugs. Yeah. Well, fortunately, that didn't catch on. But the guy, the real guy that pushed it was some guy in, in, in England. Right. And so you're thinking, oh, it was a professor or, or a king or somebody important. No, no. It's a dude that wanted more daylight hours to play golf. Golf. A golfer is messing us up every year. We gotta get up early and go to bed late and, and see that whole thing messes me up too. You got spring, okay, spring forward. That one's easy to figure out because it's not too often I spring back, you know, except if there's a poisonous snake. It's always spring forward. But fall, that always messes me up because I fall forward too. I've fallen forward, backward, sideways. I've fallen a lot. So that just messes me up. And it's a golfer that did this to us. Golf isn't even a sport. No, no. Have you seen some of these people playing golf? That's not a sport. Now, I know I've got some friends who love golf, but I'm sorry, you might be pissed off, but it's not a sport. You can't look like that and call it a sport. Uh, uh, a hot dog eating contest is, is more of a sport than golf. You know why? Because you know why? Because that fat guy doesn't win, does he? No. It's always the skinny Japanese dude. Yeah, yeah. It, and see, that's just it. I, I, you know why? Because he's got that zen-like uh, ability. You know, he, he like chop bricks in half and, and stuff a thousand hot dogs down his throat. Takes conditioning, takes skill and training. I mean, that's a sport. You know, fat, fat people, if, you, if a fat guy can win a sport, it's not a sport. It's a game, but it's not a sport. I mean, except for uh, sumo wrestling, but... Even then, I think that was originally like a joke, but they just didn't know it. Because, come on, people, it's, it's a couple of fat guys in diapers sweating on each other. It's more like a, a bad porno than a sport. No, no. So, so uh, golf, not a sport. Sumo wrestling, not, and, and like bowling. See, there's another one. Trust me. If you can be 90 and bowl, that's not a sport. It's not a sport. And... Uh, okay, uh, see, I don't like this one. I don't even consider this a sport, but it is baseball, right? Right? Because you don't have fat guys, although Babe Ruth was kind of, 
He wasn't he wasn't fit, but he was always hitting home runs. So he didn't have to run around the bases. He could take his time. But if if a fat guy if a fat guy can hit a home run, then it's not a sport. So, okay, baseball not a, not a sport, and and sumo, bowling, and golf not a sport. No, we can't let a golfer screw up our lives like this. So here's what we need to do. We need to, this Sunday, move the clocks ahead only 30 minutes. Split the difference and just be done with it, right? Don't change the clocks again. So, so what that means is that next Friday, I'll see you 30 minutes earlier. Or later. Because, okay, because if, if it's 5 o'clock and I move the clock forward to 6, it's still... Five, right? Well, like I guess it depends on. This is gonna take a lot of drinks to figure this one out. Happy Friday, everyone! Cheers.